If you have some knowledge about business and investments, you must have heard of the Oracle of Omaha, Warren Buffett. It's probably impossible to have dreamed of a successful business career without having taken inspiration from the business and investment giant himself. Having started investing and doing small-scale business from a very young age, Warren Buffett always had a stronghold on business dealings. His visionary thinking and hard work took him to new heights, and today he is one of the richest people and owns the American multinational conglomerate holding company Berkshire Hathaway. There is so much that young entrepreneurs and investors can learn from his 91-year-old life. If you're looking for advice that he has to give, then keep watching the video because we've compiled some of the best advice that Warren Buffett has ever given. So let's get into it. Number 10. Avoid the speculative nature of the stock market. Warren Buffett suggests doing some self-analysis of your investment portfolio. Are you in it for a long-term investment or are you here to gamble? Unfortunately, the stock market business is more like a casino with speculations influencing the trading. There are people who know nothing about stocks getting advice from stock brokers who know even less. Also, if you find that you're constantly selling and buying stocks, you're actually filling the pockets of others rather than your own. So do the right thing and don't speculate. Number nine, listen to only those who you trust. Who you share your dealing and decisions with matters a lot. It can make or break your investment actions. Warren Buffett is very careful who he selects as business partners and managers, and so should you be. Choose people who have the knowledge and are trustworthy. Be wary of bad folk in this field who can prey on investors' expectations to make money. Do a survey and find honest people to manage your investments and portfolios. Number eight, stock market investment is not a way to make easy money. Invest in the stock market and stay calm. It is a steady and slow way to build an income. When it comes to investment, Buffett makes no attempt to pick a few winners that will emerge from an ocean of unproven enterprises. Rather, try to find companies that have already proven their worth. He advises young people to stop trying to find the next major winner in the emerging industry and invest in those who have dealt with crashes and still maintain their value. Number seven, develop skills to fight inflation. When inflation rates are skyrocketing and people are panicking to find a solution to stay at the level where they retain their purchasing power, Warren Buffett says you should be exceptionally good at one thing. When you have a skill and are exceptional at it, people will always want to do business with you and exchange some of what they produce with what you deliver. Your skills will keep you afloat. No level of inflation can take that power away from you. Number six, own productive assets. Buffett is a keen advisor on investing in the right place, such as real estate, bonds, stock, farmland, and more. These categories produce returns for you and maintain their value with time. Assets produce value for their owners, like owning farmland produces food, and owning a plot for an apartment will generate rental income. Recently, cryptocurrency has gained a lot of popularity among new investors, but Warren Buffett says he's no fan of it. He says he wouldn't take it if you offered him all of the Bitcoin in the world for $25, because what would he do with it? Cryptocurrencies don't produce anything for their owners. Number five. That said, stay away from cryptocurrencies. As discussed, Buffett is an avid supporter of staying away from cryptocurrencies. In his opinion, it's only a mirage. He has time and time again warned investors about the danger of investing in Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. He says that it can go to zero in no time and take your hard-earned money with it down the drain. Instead, choose better investment options which pose less danger. Number four, don't take the news too seriously. 
We mainly consider that news, economic activities, and price fluctuations cause the stock market to fluctuate. This is true, but not entirely. When it comes to financial news, it should be like 99% of the investment actions should attribute to just 1% of the financial news we consume. Also, you should invest in companies that have been around a long time, have seen all the ups and downs, and still manage to stay in business. They are the ones who know how to go about the news headline triggers. Choose your investments accordingly. Number 3. Buy a stock that you plan to hold on to forever. According to Warren Buffett, his favorite holding period is forever. He emphasizes the importance of knowing and analyzing the stocks and only buying the ones that will benefit in the long run. Choose wisely while investing your money. He says if you aren't thinking of owning a stock for years, then don't even think about it for 10 minutes. He himself has held stocks for decades. If you successfully point out the businesses that grew over time and yield a high return, benefiting you as a shareholder, then you will gain great returns. Continuous trading activity eats away the profit in the form of taxes and trading commissions, so he suggests buying and sitting tight. Number 2. For acquiring assets, you must devote your money to doing so. Everyone gets the urge to spend their income as soon as it is credited to their account, and it's easy to do it too. You see all the money you have and want to buy all you want, but Warren Buffett says otherwise. He says if you're going to build wealth, you must save first. The amount you spend must be what is left after you've saved the greater part of your income. Saving should be your first priority. Decide how much money you require to accomplish important goals you have. Then spend the rest of the money as you wish. And number one, never invest in a business you cannot understand. We all know that investing is a big part of the American dream, but it's important to be careful when you start investing. You can make some great investments and lose money on others, but if you don't understand the business or its industry, how can you know if it will succeed? You can lose money with any type of investment, but some industries are more prone to fraud than others. So before investing in any business, make sure to research its industry and how it operates so that you know what to expect from the company and its practices. This way, you'll be able to make better decisions when it comes time to sell your shares. That's it for today. We hope you found our video interesting. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with others. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new uploads. In the end, thanks for watching and see you next time.